the first point that is additional treatment required you grade from 1 to uh, 10 remaining yes you grade from 0 to 5 or 1 uh, 0 to 5 or 1 to 5 then we have s a sepsis you have to be very confident in this a sepsis itself stands for mnemonic a sepsis word is itself a mnemonic let us see this a sepsis also So, A sepsis score, this is a point based scoring system, this is a point based scoring system, the point the calculation will never be asked in your exam, actually you should be knowing what are the parameters, A additional treatment required, additional treatment required, now what do you mean by additional treatment required, yes, imagine a patient is admitted in the hospital and patient has been operated post surgery there was some wound infection for which the patient needed some additional treatment like longer doses of antibiotic use maybe incision and drainage maybe debridement so additional treatment required in form of iv antibiotics iv antibiotics debridements incision and drainage incision and drainage so these are the additional unusual treatment which was done to the patient this was not anticipated the patient was brought with some follow-up cholecystectomy and patient in the post-operative phase developed a port side what collection it may be requiring what a drainage sometimes may be requiring a broader uh, broad spectrum antibiotics to be used for a long time so these are very important things so additional treatment required this is a s stands for serious discharge serious discharge e stands for erythema around the wound erythema around the wound yes erythema around the wound p stands for yes purulent discharge so if there is a purulent discharge the first point yes the first point that is additional treatment required you grade from 1 to uh, 10 remaining yes you grade from 0 to 5 or 1 uh, 0 to 5 or 1 to 5 then we have s a sepsis s for separation of skin you must have heard of the wound dehiscence the wound gets dehized off so sepsis and separation separation of wound yes or no so separation of wound edges basically it is then i stands for isolation of bacteria isolation of bacteria now what do you mean by isolation of bacteria it is a culture that we require and we have taken out culture so isolation of bacteria then last s is stay stay what do you mean by stay the stay is prolonged the stay is prolonged by more than two weeks so if for the conventional management of the patient yes you had to keep the patient in the hospital for a longer time this is what is considered as prolonged hospital stay so all these points a s e p s i s a sepsis these are actually a point based calculation system that we do for them next is let us move forward now so we have completed the chapter of wounds we have completed the chapter wounds